All right, here we go. Hello, folks. Didn't like that. I could like do like this and act like I had a companion in life. All right, we're just gonna start off like this because this body language makes this intro even 10 times more awkward than I already have made it. Now, if it isn't clear by now, I am a gal on a budget. I am in college. I do work, but I am in college, which is the main component of why I'm on a budget. And even if I wasn't in college, I have just always grown up very frugal and I don't like wasting money where I don't have to. So in the past, probably like three years, the last two years for sure, I have gotten so into thrift shopping to the point where regular retail shopping for me is one, overwhelming, two, way out of the budget, and three, just not enjoyable because it's not a game so much. Also, it's great for the environment. It's sustainable fashion at its core. So I am on summer break in I think a week, a week and a half. I'm making a pledge to myself that I am only going to buy clothes at thrift stores this year. And so today, about an hour ago, I went to Goodwill and I had a very successful trip. Key tip, if you're going to Goodwill, I've said it before and I'll say it again, bring a donation bag because then they give you a coupon to use for when you shop there. Okay, so we're gonna just pull things out of the bag, which by the way, I got this bag there, but we'll get there last. So the first thing I got are these jeans and these are, they go to about like mid calf. They're not capris, but they're like a little bit above the ankle. They're stretchy jeggings and they're from New York and Company. So cute, so flattering. And these were only $4.99. Did that even focus? I don't think so. Next thing, I got these shorts and these are kind of fake jeans. I don't know. They're denim, but they're not because they're very loose and they're a little big around the waist, but I can just tie them. These were only $1.99. All right, this top is so cute. Um, it is originally from Target. This top, and it like zips up in the front, um, and then it's kind of tied. It's very boho. I don't know if I use boho in the right context, but that's what I, the vibe I get. I love this, and this was only $3.99. Next up. It's this beautiful jacket, and I love the wrist because, I don't know, like tufts? I don't know, whenever I hear the word tuff, it has like a very gross connotation. And it was $6.99, and it fits like a guante. Glove. Next up, this is just kind of like a summer staple. It's from American Eagle, and it's one of their soft and sexy tanks, so this fabric is so soft just want comfort in the summer and that definitely definitely fits that criteria this is so cute this is something that you would see on i don't know what are trendy sites that girls and people shop on princess polly i don't know i never buy stuff off there but it's this romper and then it ties in the back so cute, it's so comfortable, but it was only $5.99. Crazy. This at a regular store would be probably 30 bucks. And then the last clothing item I got. This definitely is out of the comfort zone for me, but you know, the fun thing at Goodwill is you can justify buying things that you probably might only wear once because they're so cheap. But I tried it on and I was like, this might be hideous, but I love it. It's this full body length jumpsuit. It's so comfortable and it's super lightweight and flowy too. So even you could wear this in the summer and not get hot. And this was only $5.99. Oh my gosh, it smells like Goodwill. If you've ever shopped at a Goodwill, you know the smell. Okay, and the last and final purchase that I got was this. It's definitely fake leather, but it's so nice. It's brand new, originally from Target. And at Target, it costs $39.99, but then at Goodwill, it was $14.99. So it definitely wasn't cheap for Goodwill standards, but I wanted a bag like this for this summer. Um, 
for my internship so I can just like put my laptop and my lunch in here and it looks cute too. And all in all, drum roll please, for one bag, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven articles of clothing, I got all of this for $42. $42 is what this alone would cost at a regular store. Highly recommend to anyone who is either balling on a budget or just wants a more enhanced, exciting shopping experience to try Goodwill. It definitely in the past few years has destroyed that stereotype it used to have of just being like grungy stuff. They have really nice stuff. So much of it actually still has the tags on it from old stores. And it's great for the environment because um, you're recycling other people's clothes and giving them a second life. I am gonna go. I just ate a solid like five course meal, so I am feeling a little bloated. Gonna go lie down. And that's a detail I didn't need to share. And until next time,